Blasting that classical music in a downtown tunnel is just one technique the city of Albuquerque is using to make an area not exactly known for its safety, a place where people could feel comfortable just passing through, but not sticking around. Brianna Wilson takes us through the multiple improvements officials have made in recent weeks at the first and central underpass. This underpass at Central and First Street has typically been an area that people want to avoid, but the city of Albuquerque doesn't want it to stay that way. Make it so friendly and so safe that people are no longer concerned about having to, you know, fear for uh, being uh, robbed or uh, any sort of, uh, you know, vandalism that might take place. With a budget of close to $67,000, city officials have made several updates in recent weeks they hope will make a lasting impact, like the addition of new lights and music in the tunnel that will run 24-7. It is loud. It was so loud we could hardly hear each other, that but got, that's kind of the point. We want it to be loud enough that it discourages people from hanging out, but we also don't want it so loud for the residents that live here. And it seems to be working. We've had campers here, and I've noticed in the last couple of weeks nobody's in this general area, so to speak. City officials say they also added fresh coats of paint to cover graffiti and assigned crews to power wash walkways in this area twice a week. They've also beefed up security. APD has a presence, more of a presence than they did before. So they'll come throughout the day and patrol even at night, walk from one end to the other. Metro security officers are patrolling nearby areas as well, and these are not the only safety updates in the works downtown. We're looking at installing gates at 3rd and 5th Street so that uh, it actually protects uh, pedestrians that are downtown at night. We're working closely with APD to uh, improve the, the way that they barricade anywhere from 2nd to about 7th Street. All changes to make this area safer and more enjoyable. Reporting in downtown Albuquerque, Brianna Wilson, KOB4.